Before these people go continue, you get person where I go live, make she narrate her story. Make when I hear within the Nigerian police do this woman. Make when I understand now she as then they talk, now she I sight. Nigerian police no get conscience. Their leadership no get conscience. Are they talk them? If they got conscience, may them, may them face me, make I, I, make I explain to them. We him be conscience. This woman, husband, they send them abroad to go and do peacekeeping mission. They attack them. The man. We don't do this woman case many times. The Nigerian police is so shameful that they, can, they cannot attend to this woman's case. When I go hear her story, Nami talks and make them carry her come again. If a, a DIG can look at me in the face and tell me they are police work, now a dog, a chop dog. That was the end of my relationship with that DIG. He don't retire now. He don't scatter. See in life. Diabetes and other sickness don't enter him. He gets stroke now. And he go continue to get that stroke. When I go hear Mrs. Boniface's story. Why? I mean, they look for her. I don't see her. Now, when you they talk at the check screen, now I see... Mrs. Boniface for your back. Mrs. Boniface, you go tell your story from the beginning to the end. N Imagine, say, you never talk your story before. I want the whole world to listen to this woman's cry. Make you understand, say, police know they they fair to police. They be big ones, now then they chop money for police. Mrs. Boniface. Please sit down, man. Take your time. Tell us your story, man. From the beginning to the end. Anything where you feel remember. Good morning, ordinary Ahmed. Good morning, Birgitte family. My name is Mary Boniface. My husband is a inspector. He's supposed to be ASP that time, <coughs> but they deny him rank. And now they went to peacekeeping in 2010, 2010. They went peacekeeping in Liberia. Where they go to peacekeeping, I they call them with a talk. Sometimes I don't go get them, sometimes I go get them. So you can't stay long and not get them. I can't get them. I tell and say, are they find you? I know they hear you. Waiting happen. He can't tell me say sometime. Then they carry them go bush. We are network no day. So anytime where I call them, I no get a make. I no worry. Maybe they day for that place. That time remains small. Make them come. So they supposed to come 2011. Then go 2010. They supposed to come 2011 March. So you don't need to make them come. I define them, I know they see them like two weeks. I define them, I know they get them. So I don't worry, I say maybe they don't carry them, go where he tell me. I don't know saying another thing happen. So I did, I mean, I just they happy. I just they happy. I say, ah, my husband don't close to come make, I renew my house. Welcome him peacefully. So I don't they prepare my house, buy things buy his food flowers, everything I change for him, so that I want to welcome him very happy. So I don't know, say my husband, don't get accident. And the reason of accident, they went to carry president for her office. On the way coming back, like two weeks to come back to Nigeria. On the way coming back, they get accident. So as they get accident, my husband, Come out inside car, fell down, and the car almost come fall on top of him. So the car won't catch fire. People rush, come. They come quench the fire. They begin to commote people inside car. So now another person will go to use them. 
He can say, hey, it be like somebody they own that car. They can't carry the car up. They want put on one side. The car can't come out again. Hit them for, for day again. So for day, according to people where they did their life, the one woman tell me, say, they cry, cry for my husband, say he don't die. So they carry him, go hospital. They go say he never die in their life. They keep him for Liberia there for hospital. So for two weeks, then they did there. No treatment. So my husband, they are about three in that car that they get serious injury. So my husband only, they worse, pass the other two. So from there, they say, no, they no go to do their treatment, my husband's treatment for Liberia. They're supposed to carry and go another country. They can't carry my husband and go to Liberia. Me, I did here, I know no know what they happen. Say, till til. the team where they go, they come back. But uh, for our barrack, I would see people, then they talk. If I go close, then we change another story. So I meet one lady, I tell her, say, hi. This thing where people do what thing happen now. She tell me, say, nothing happened. I say, my husband go peacekeeping, but I don't understand. She tell me, say, if something happened, police go let me know. I say, okay. So remain like three days where then they come. We they inside our my house. Now here no kindle. Police then come. They are about three in number. I open door, they say, Are you Mrs. Boniface? I say yes. They say, eh. I am your husband's friend for our office because my husband is more than 21. Uh, they say they bring form for our office. I feel for your husband, but I forget his number. Do you have your husband's number for head? I say yes. I be he leave your handset for house. I say no. You don't carry your handset. Go peacekeeping. I feel given the number. I say yes. I can't write the number. I give the man. As I give the man the number, I can't work out. Go. I no worry. Two days. One day's interval, he come back again. A day inside room again, I can't hear their voice. Forget. From there, my mind can't caught. I can't say, ah, uh ah. -uh. Those men, they come there before yesterday. We didn't bring them today again. The moment they knock my door, I jump. I jack his uh, uniform. I say, Oga, not be there before yesterday when I come here. We didn't carry when I come today again. He say, no. Nothing. I just say they want see me. I say I do want see me. He say yes. I say ah. ah. What thing happen? I be my husband die. He say no, madam. If your husband die, they will tell. I say no. Not be only my husband. First go peacekeeping this barrack. Oh. People didn't go, but I never see police. You can't see their family. Mm -hmm. Why my own? Two times now when they come and tell me if if my husband die. He say no, he never die. But what happened to him? He say no. I just say me they conquered me. From there I started crying. They asked me why are they cry. I say ah ah. Why are they cry? What thing happened to my husband? They no greet me. They can't even go for a quarter. As they say IG, they call me. They don't call me go IG office. They can't even go peacekeeping office. I see their ogre. When I just enter, the ogre say, Madam, why are you crying? I say, ah, ogre, why are we not cry? When you say, they say IG want to see me. Where are the IG? Now he say, now you send them, they come call me. I say, what happened to my husband? Did my husband die or what? They say, no, your husband get accident. But the accident where your husband get, if they bring him back to Nigeria, even you and your family, who are not go fit treat him. I say, Jesus, what happened to my husband that we cannot treat him in Nigeria? Is it alive? They say, yes, my husband is alive. But they carry him where he go receive treatment. Till he well before they go carry him come back to me. I say, okay, how can I see him? They say, no, madam, you cannot see him. I say, ah, ah. But now, I see things don't change now. They feel see person from America to this Nigeria. When I feel show me where he lie down, make I believe say he there alive. They say nobody there alive. If he die, police they know they high date now again. I say okay, but where I wanna carry and go? As where I wanna carry and go? Who go pay the treatment money? They say no, not be you, oh madam. Say be a peace keeping he go. I say yes. Now you end. Then go three times till he well. Everything at them then go do for him. I say okay, no worry. Just pray for your husband, make it get well. If you will, then we'll bring him for you. I say, okay. Go house. I turn back. Come house. I can't sit down. I did cry. I can't sit down one day. I can't say, I which come home I do. I supposed to ask them, make them give me the address of that hospital and the telephone number so that I will try to call my husband, whether he's alive or dead. So I went back again. I say, Oga, 
I need the hospital number. I want to call my husband to hear from him. They say, no, even them, they did not get the hospital number, a telephone number. I say, ah, ah, Oga, why will you carry your child, go to hospital, and now you are telling me that you don't know the hospital telephone number that I can communicate with my husband. They do me police work like this, like this. They send me back. I come back. Since then, I keep going to force a quarter, asking them for for a telephone number. Like three months, I don't get any better result. So when I come back, before they come back, they send to me, make I go carry my husband back. When I went to carry my husband sorry, back, now you sorry, one officer. Sorry, ma, make I interrupt you. Yes. Before this woman, husband, come back from South Africa. Then be send money and visa where this woman supposed to go to South Africa to go and stay with her husband. Have you not be so? Yes, sir. Somebody divert the visa and the money. This man day when other countries will send their officers go for this peacekeeping go. If they get this kind of thing, not be South African and they carry them go. Now US and UK. And now immediately then they evacuate them. Our own Nigerian, they stay small. Then when he did for South Africa, nobody was there to take care of him. Iron for him out, iron everywhere. You remember, ma? Yes, sir. This they man cannot... They go put uh, down for iron. They carry nail, uh, 12 inches. That long one, now they tight inside his head. Because the neck enter inside. When he fell down, the neck enter inside. So they go tight. They go tight. When he came back, now I see the place. So they tight nail from here. They tight here. They tight here. They okay. tight here, they tight here, and they put iron, all in body and all iron. He in cannot body. even turn. He there for hospital. Okay. So as Oga said, Wait me. Now. He get one time where this man did thirsty. Nobody to give him water. That, that thing where some South Africans know like us. But that, tell us the story. Tell us the story. When I try, try, I did not give me the number. Now I can't remember, say, one dear Oga tell me, say, Madam, take this number. The first doctor that carry her husband go hospital, he say, make you give Jacob. That Jacob is my son, my firstborn. That time when my husband go prescribing, it's only six years, going to seven years. So he say, make I give Jacob, make Jacob call the doctor. The doctor say, make Jacob call him. Now I tell the Oga, say, Oga, Jacob na six plus o, na seven, you know, get handset. When I con the waka like that, I can't worry, nobody will go help me. Now I can't think one night like that, say, ah, then give me number. Let me try to call that first doctor number, make I hear where my husband is. Now I can't call. In the night around 11 something, I call the number. Now the doctor pick. As he pick, he asked me, with who in the talk? I say with you. Mrs. Boniface, your patient. He say, oh, 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 Mrs. Boniface. I say, sir, how was your husband? I say, my husband, doctor. He say, yes, how is he feeling? I say, I don't know where my husband is. He say, what? Uh -huh. Are you not with your husband? Who is with your husband? Is this man who you call now, Nigerian or being a foreigner? No, now foreigner. Mm -hmm. He say, is this not, is this your, or your brother husband is with him? I say, nobody, sir. I don't even know that something like that. He said, What? Nigeria, eh, for say quarter, they didn't give you visa. I say, Visa. He said, Yes. I say, No, sir. He now he asked me, say, Did you have your personal visa? I say, No, sir. He keep quiet like five minutes. I say, Hello, hello. He said, Madam, let me see what I can do. I say, Okay. Now I stay. He said, I will call you back on Friday, on Saturday. That is Thursday night we are doing. So that Saturday, he didn't call me. Sunday, he didn't call me. I can't say, God, what is happening? So a Monday night again, I call him back. When I call him back, I say, doctor, 
please, I am sorry to disturb you, but what I need from you, please just help me with telephone number for where my husband is lying down. The hospital telephone number, I don't need anything from you because my spirit is telling me that maybe they shut his mouth. So he keep quiet. He say, Madam, I say, yes. He say, I will give you the telephone number, but please don't allow anybody to know that I am the one that give you that telephone number. When are they From here? there, I know that something is happening. I say, okay. I promise him with God. I say, I will not allow anybody to know. He gives me two numbers. He said, try this number. You will get your husband. Now, I try the number. I go to my husband. The boat is very deep. Very, very deep. I shout Jesus because it's a secret something. I can't shout. I say Jesus in my heart. Because I don't want anybody to ask me what happened. Mm -mm. So I say, what happened to you, Baba and Jacob? He said, he's very pain. He's inside pain. I say, okay. From there, I don't know where I did again. I say, God. So... We started communication with my husband. I will hear some words. Now the last word that he told me, he said, he has iron in his mouth. He cannot speak because if he opens his mouth, nail is choking him. So <laughs> from there I say, okay, God will see you through. Now we still they communicate. I will call him like 10 times a day to hear his voice, whether he die or he's alive. Sometimes you will tell me that he's feeling to drink water, but no one to give him the water. <laughs> he will tell me like that. We go inside kitchen first water. We say, I want water for hand, but God will give you that water. <laughs> because I don't know how to fly to come to South Africa to give you water. My God is there with you. Sometimes we say South Africa we come and see doctor, we try to keep water on it with him for his own center table. They will come and push it to the other one and say that Nigeria they are wicked. They will push the water and leave him. Now I keep going to first headquarters asking them that hand, number of the hospital and said I didn't show them that I get it. So one day we are doing like that with my husband. So one day he can call me, he say Doctor tell him that Nigeria police, they asked them to send him back to Nigeria. And before he told me that, he said, they tell and say, Doctor tell and say, he will do his treatment class one to eight. That class one to eight, he is in class three. And they want to operate him because he has injury for back. So the injury, because nobody to turn him for the bed that he sees, the wound, he go deep. If you see the wound for my husband, but you will see his bone. You will put your hand inside the hand, go enter. When they carry him, come back. I say, God, what happened? So they disturb them. He come to me, say, he no one died for South Africa. As police, then they disturb doctor. Doctor said they will bring him back. I say, okay, I cannot do anything. What can I do, God? So from there, the Oga called me from first headquarters. I said, they won't bring my husband. Now I went. I asked him a question. I said, Oga, did my husband heal? He said, eh, eh, eh. It, the way I spoke, that is how he said, eh, Mrs. Boniface, you know, eh, there is important place that they're supposed to do for your husband. The place that they do it mm. now. The remaining one, they can continue in Nigeria. I said, okay. But if they bring him back, who will continue with the treatment? He says, still your husband is in, he there for you and hand. They will treat him. Make her no worry about bill for Nigeria for hospital. Where they will bring him? They say, National Hospital. I say, okay, no problem. He sent me, say, which food my husband like best, my go cook. For him. I said, okay. I went and I go to market and they prepare the food where I go cook. Small time he can call me, say, my husband don't arrive for airport, but make I not go to national hospital. Make I come to police cantonment private hospital there. 
I say police can tell me. They say yes. I say me. I know no police can tell me. Oh, he say me. I give the driver my phone. I give the driver. They direct the place to the driver. I go there. When I go there, I know the barrack because I used to go to the barrack and I I know the cleaning. It's very small. You know this this place. This place they will share it into three. So I saw one tiny bed, like those beds that before we used to use it in secondary school, 10, 10 spring. Naim, they put small bed like a student uh, mattress on it. I see the room very dusty, very dirty. Uh -uh. When I enter, I shout. I see my husband for the bed. I cry, and he too is crying. I say, what is going on? So from there, I see the doctor will bring them, then they fight with police. They drag themselves to first headquarters. When the doctor come back, he come tell me, say, Madam, I am alone among the, the police, so I cannot do with them. I ask them to take your husband to national, from national hospital with the quarry. They no agree, they pass my power, carry your husband, come here. Now but police, anything- wait, wait, now one of the police doctors one of the ministry, uh, the doctor, where they joined him with my husband for South Africa hospital. Could Nahin Khan they tell you, say, yes. in the in the alone in their midst, say, yes. he insist me then carry your husband go national hospital. Then but, go national, he insist from airport, uh, airport from airport. Hospital. Say make them carry him come national hospital mm -hmm. and now they carry and call national hospital so as they call national hospital they call the police say make them bring money make them deposit money mm. where they will carry my husband put for bed and the police say they no get money make them carry and now go they back carry and come put for that dusty dirty yes room. they go put them for there so he tell me say madam i won't go back i cannot stay here i will go back but anything will happen to your husband call me and tell me this is my number I say, okay, sir. So he left. After their stream, if they won't give an injection, they will say, Madam, go buy. I will go buy. What I will Now do. you can't they buy with your money now? Yes. I go buy because I What of the wound were there for back of your husband? Now so he did and they three times and go just come up the all this uh, spirit, all this thing. Now they had and they for back we do we don't we don't we don't open so te, then yes. they see him bone for back yes and as a result of that show you have best show here and here all the wound here and here and back so i i anything i go buy some drugs then go send me me i go buy i go go buy because daddy I, I don't daddy please sit down sir get the place to i sit. don't need to ask now, question again observe. my prayer is that make my husband well so i did here one day i can't see say kai this treatment I no go stay, my husband die for my eye like that. Now I enter doctor office. I can't ask doctor. I say, doctor, why are you keeping quiet? See how my husband uh, situation is. Do you want my husband to die? If you no go, when I no go change my husband hospital, I will carry my husband come out here. The doctor say, no, no carry him. will not put me in trouble. I say, okay, so man, no put you for trouble. Now you won't put me for trouble, ba? Make my husband die, leave me with children, ba? So I will carry my husband. I went out to carry drop. The doctor follow me because he man a police. He follow me. He called the temi. If you remember the doctor name, I get. I no get his name, but I get his number. Okay. He Continue. come tell me, say, Madam, me in a cadet I be. I don't know, say, na police work day like this. If I know, I will not enter police. Please help me. Help me come back. I will go to first quarter and talk. Now he go to first quarter. He go talk. They go tell and say, IG don't travel. Make he come back. Wait till IG come back. He come tell me, I say, eh? Make I wait for my husband wait mm. for the day like this till I go come back. Which day I go come back? Me, I go carry my husband come out. So I just the worry the doctor, worry the doctor. I, at last, I can't jack him. I say, if my husband die, you might go follow him. I go kill you with my hand. If you not do it the right thing, what you're supposed to do. Now you wrong, go for sake what I go talk. As you go talk, then give an emblem. They give an emblem, you cut the emblem, come. I can't see. He asked me where I want to carry my husband. Go. I said, I want to carry and go any hospital. So somebody come to see us. He can't say, uh, you see one hospital for Caro. 
You see one of those people where India people then they operate and then they do that can this kind of husband work, people then they well make I carry and go there. So now from there I carry my husband, we reach there. Now I send my husband brother, say go for a quarter, go and meet Oga peacekeeping. As Nayi tell me, say, you end and go treat my husband. Tell and say, I don't carry my husband. Go to a Premo hospital for Caro. So make him give you money, make you come. So as you go, you go worry him. Nayi the man, go carry, five, give her money, 500,000. He carry and come. As he carry and come, that 500,000. What he pay me, say, the file where the doctor carry come for uh, South Africa, transfer file where they transfer them. Police go hide them. They no agree. Make it, they give us. Hmm. As we reach for that hospital, doctor asks us for transfer a, a file. They say, where the file? Where they give them for South Africa? We say, we no get file. They say, okay, now, then go start treatment like a my fresh. husband get accident now, now, because they don't know where they go start treatment. They, I say, okay, do everything that you people will do. They carry and enter places where they enter and then they do and wait and wait. And. All my husband say they don't do this one for me for South Africa. Uh, yeah. They say, okay, some places. So you say they are filed there now. They for Shabi waiting, uh, uh, waiting, they don't do for South Africa already. Yes, sir. So the 500,000 can't finish for you test. can finish for all those things. So we stay 10 days for that hospital. They come ask me for another money. I don't go for a quarter. I go tell the ogre. Now what do you go tell me? Say, madam, do you know how I suffer before I get that 500? Who they tell you so? The, the ogre, the na, name na CP Jimeta, that time. The man, man is late. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. He don't die last, this year, Abi last year. He died, ba? He died during mm -hmm. uh, June or July. Mm, he died? He died. Mm, because that is my prayer. I will not hide it. I tell God that if this man had day for my husband dead, let him prove. I will not lie, ordinary Ahmed, because every blessing that I will need myself. I keep praying for people where they kill my husband. The painful I suffer with my husband when they say, he no get money again, go back and carry a husband to their house. I say, eh, make I go carry him. Okay, help me with ambulance because I can't carry my husband for any car. Mm, he because say, of eh, in condition. For in condition, he said, they no get ambulance. May I go hire a motor, carry him. I went back. He come back. I went back. Go hire moto. Go carry my husband. Squeeze him inside again. Squeeze him inside the in yes. moto. Not the ambulance. Not the ambulance. We come back from there. I look for a doctor because I can't, I don't know how to treat that wound. I don't know how to do my husband. The doctor is coming to our house every month. One hundred fifty-five thousand. I go pay every month. Every month. Which year? That is 2011. 2011. Every month, 155,000. That should be like 800 or 900,000 naira now. Continue, man. So they keep coming. They are treating my husband when they came. Some of them go operate. They go cut the meat of part of my husband. Operate him inside my house. Inside your room? Yes. Because doctor will tell me if they don't remove the tissue, my husband will not get better. So I will stand with cry. I go to watch. I go to watch the way they are doing it. I go to video the thing where they need to do. But, but always, I come pray. God, come hear my prayer. Now I told my husband that you will not die. When the ogre tell me, say my husband is not used to police again. My husband is not used to police. He cannot walk to police again. I sent uh, from wait, here. Wait, in your God talk, say your husband not they useful to police again. Yes, that is what he told what me. What be the name of the person who tell you this CP rubbish? CP Jimeta. Oh, they are saying one will die. Okay. Now, as he told me that, and I get moral, I get boldness. I know no the time where, where power come into me. Yes. I stand, I face him, I say, please let me tell you. Wait now, madam. Sir. He look you for face. For face, Oga okay. asked me. Your husband is no longer useful to the yes, Nigerian police. Yes, yes, yes. That is what he told me. In the useful there. now. From there, I get boldness. I stand, I say, I call him, I say, Oga, you say my husband is not useful to police work again. He say, yes. I say, I promise you today, mark it. 
if you go to your office, mark it. What God did to my life is more than what devil did to my husband. What devil still in my husband's body is God that created that thing. And I believe that God will bring it back again. Mm. Stay and wait. I pray that you will not die. My husband will come back to this first headquarter and work for you people again. Mm. Believe me, you will see my God. So I left him. Mm. So when I came back, every blessing day, my ordinary Ahmed, mm. I will cry to God. We will cry together with my husband. I told him that if he know that he commit any sin, let him surrender himself to God because I want to prove something for his ogre and I want God to answer us. Now we keep praying, fasting, praying, fasting. And my husband, that wound, he can't heal. Mm. The wound, he can't heal. All everywhere he can't heal. As he can't heal. My husband, where he is not feeling anything, because even you bite him for you know, from, they feel pain from again. his waist to down here, he not go feel him, except from here to here. Mm. So when I, I was buffing him, I will carry to pick. I will to took for his lap. leg. Mm. He will tell me, hey, he's paining him. <laughs> I will took another blade. You say, ah, I took him all. He feel it. Mm. That is how I used to do. Mm. So one day I took, I carry and put him for a chair. He can't hold window, stand. I happy. Mm. I say, God, thank you for answering mm. prayer. When people come to greet my husband, they will ask me, where is the sick person? They're not going to say I'm a husband because mm. the way he fresh, he look good. If you see him, he's not going to say, now the man will get that. Accident. And now for your room, then treat now him. Now for my room, then they treat him. So we did there, oh, you know, saying they use catheter. As doctor, and doctor told me that that catheter will not stay more than two weeks. You must change, we'll change it. Yes. I said, okay. So the doctor, where they come, they treat us. He come work out. I don't know what I plan. Oh, what an a better worker and no no. You know Greek come back again. I call him when they cut it at least Two uh, weeks. twelve days. Uh, because you can't see you know they come again. Now me can they dress some wound. Uh, uh. He come sees. And you know, still they, they pay him. Yes. So as I call him, he tell me say he go kogi, he won't go write exam. But he go send in in workers and go come do him. I wait to, now from there, now he does fever, can't start him. Because they don't tell me, say, mm. if they not change him, he go get fever. Mm. Now infection, infection, one year. Infection. So make them come out him. So I know, oh. see, I can't send for pharmacy, say, make them call nurse, make them change. They not say, now 20,000. I say, make she come, come change him. I go give her the 20,000. So they not not come, come. Uh, yeah. I send for another pharmacy, they say 30,000. I say, make they come, come change him. They not come. Oh. From there, now one of my neighbor can say, Ah, Mrs. Boniface, will I not do that hospital where police and they do? Where you go carry a husband go? I say, And we do a go. Uh, I say, we, NHIS. Yes, I say, We get, oh, but you know, say, My mind not go there again. He say, Okay, let me go and bring her to carry a husband to that hospital. Now we can't carry and go. Now he might try, sit down for Kiki. We push her, he go in Taka, we carry and go. The doctor go check. He come on the catheter, change them. The doctor say, no problem. Now that catheter way, he reach like 16 days, they don't change them. Mm. Now he, they give him fever. So make her not try, leave her, make it pass. Mm. That day the way they give me again. Mm. So we can go back to house. So that catheter way, they remove. Now he doctor say, carry and go through where, madam. I pack the catheter, go through where. Say, if I come back, the driver will carry us go. You sit down, they wait to us. Say, we will go back to house. <laughs> when I come, they call the people where they follow me. They tell me, say, we sit and they carry our husband go upstairs. I say, ah, waiting happen again. <laughs> now I fly, rush with Ron, go meet my husband for bed. I say, ah, Daddy Jacob, what happened? 
he laughed because the man is too funny. Mm -mm. Anything I laugh, small mm -mm. thing I laugh. Oh, yeah. He no day hatch like that. Mm -mm. So, na peaceful man, mm -mm. I'm not going to lie for him because he no day. Mm -mm. So, he can't lie. I say, you, you know, they're serious. I'm going to ask you something. You go to laugh. Waiting, they hold you again. He said, nothing, oh, my dear. They just come and say, they admit him. I say, you know, ask them, say, waiting happen. He said, why you go ask them? Now, then be doctor. I said, after doctor, tell us, say, we go, go house. So for which hospital be this? For uh, King's Care mm. Zone Four, that is former Alassan Clinic. Mm. That time, then they call King's Care. Mm. So they keep on there, me I did there, small time because early in the morning, as the people are the warrior, you know, eat anything. Now my neighbor asked me, say your husband don't chop food. I say no, he never chop. They say, oh yeah, go house, go cook food, bring for him and cook for children too. I say no, I don't want go. They say, no, go. I say, I don't want to go. They say, go. I say, I don't want to go. They say, ah, you know, trust us. We will day here. We go wait for your husband. If it is say you will leave your husband alone, we go wait you for here. Go cook food. Come. Okay, I can't come out. I go. I go to cook food. My mind no agree. My mind no agree. I do fast. I rush, carry drop. Reach hospital. The moment I did drop for Tazi like this, I want to enter the hospital. I can't eat my leg. But... I won't fall down. I shouted, Jesus, with voice. No, they don't look me. Now, from there, I pick rush with wrong. I run with foot. I climb upstairs. I, the moment I push door, enter, I see my husband with dream. I asked myself. With what? With drip, drip for hand. I mm. say, Baba and Jacob, why do you allow them to put drip for you? What did they do for you? They said they give an injection. I said, why do you allow them to give you injection? Mm -mm. You why? You I give. I say, which type of injection? What did they tell you? Say they hold you. Why are you allowed to give you? Ex I give them the ask question on, on, on. Those women say, ah, mommy, Jacob, are you crazy? What happened? Why you come with vest like this? I say, no. At my mind, they tell me something for house. Mm. Why do you allow them to which type of injection? He come, the man come, they laugh. My husband, they laugh. I say, you, they laugh. I am serious, who? So those women that time where they do around seven, those women seven leave in the morning, be in, in the evening. Mm. Those women leave hospital after seven. The moment eight o'clock, knock. My husband told me that he no understand his own breach again. Who? If he they breach, you know they go. You know they, you know they reach you know where they, he's supposed to reach. In breach, you know they complete. Yes, again. you know they complete again. May I go call doctor from that seven thirty. I go doctor office mode. I never sit down like this two minutes. If I go, they will tell me doctor no day. If I go, they will say doctor no day. If I go, no, they will say doctor no day. The funny thing that he can't show me say yes, there are something they don't already finish my husband. When I go, the doctor, the nurses, they will look themselves for eye like this. Mm. Look themselves mm. for eye. They will put their head for down. For ground. For ground. I will mm. say, ah, uh ah, -uh. when I no call doctor, they say, madam, we call and we in, they come till 5.30 in the in morning. The, in, in, in the morning? Yes. From that 7 o'clock? 7.30 till 5.30 when my husband, from there I come, they notice my husband body, all in feet, where he never know they were come more than how many months, how many years. He did like picking, small picking on. Mm -hmm. He did see blood, they flush inside mm -hmm. my husband's leg. Mm -hmm. I can't see his leg turn black like charcoal. He don't black like charcoal. Mm -hmm. In body, they black, they go. They black, they go. Now I can't, uh -uh. if he try to talk, he go open mouth for me. He go try to hold my hand, but I go feel the hand very soft. Like small picking. I go to call and say, Daddy Jacob, what is happening? You promised me that you will never die, you will survive. What are you doing now? Now, one lady, he did for that uh, word. He can't tell me, say, in brother, he carry him brother, come, he's sick like that. Maybe in a sickness, hold my husband. Ma, go press in stomach if my husband move in a sickness. Now I go, I go hold my husband's stomach, press him. I see, say, you know, even shake. Mm -mm. I can't shout, Jesus. He asked me, say, no shake. I say, no, now the woman come put head for down. From there, I know, say, everything don't finish. Mm. When the doctor come around five something, the doctor can't stand for me, for my friends, like this. He can't say, eh, hey, madam. He say, what happened? Now, say, so they look me. What did they do, your husband? Come around now.
As he tell me, say, what did they do your husband? I say, doctor, are you asking me what did they do your patient? Am I a doctor? Mm -hmm. He say, your husband cannot talk. Mm -mm. When he see the way he's breathing, mm. he say, your husband cannot talk by himself. Mm -hmm. I say, doctor, Person don't you see to him? Breathe, uh, are you asking what me, don't you see doctor my name? husband? What be his name? Sir, I don't know his name. Oh. I don't know Which his hospital? Name. Uh, King's Care, Al Hassan Hospital. Mm. So, he said, what do you want make I do for your husband? He asked me that question. What do you want make I do for your husband? Do you want me to put oxidy? As he called oxidy, I can't shout. I say, mm. I say, when my husband is serious sick, they Una never no put, put oxidy. oxidy for him. What did happen now? Where you they ask me for oxidy? Now you mm. go carry one dirty oxidy where you don't die, finish. Mm. Come cover your mouth with it. From there, oh, I tell my own, don't finish. So when my husband is about to leave this world, God, <laughs> the bed never, <laughs> I tried to hold my husband. He just didn't go, jack her up, come down, jack her up, Only come you. down. <laughs> did, I don't know what they give up. <laughs> he can't they jack the man up. Put her down, Jack come up, put her and down. And only you they try to now hold only him. me they try to hold her for What of the nurses and the doctors for the Nobody hospital? Nobody close to me. Nobody. They don't leave me alone. So as the thing as you can't die, finish. Ordinary I mm -hmm. People then they die for my hand, but I never see my husband dead when somebody die like that. The moment he died, <laughs> she sweat. He sweat all in t-shirt for, for body. He soak. Mm -hmm. See water, they come down from my husband's face. See mm -hmm. water. Mm -hmm. So I can't touch him, body, they hot. Very hot. I can say, oh God, what happened? I, I shout. Since I leave that place, doctor never come to see my husband's dead body. For bed for that hospital. As I come here, I come to tell you the story. If you remember, one Oibo man for America called you and tell you, say they inject them with that injection away, then they keep people. Mm. <laughs> they inject my husband, kill him. <laughs> and the funny thing, the UN peacekeeping composition, competition where, where they compensate him the money where you and give him because the GID medical doctor for first quarter tell me, say, they don't give my husband plenty money and house and car. And his children, they will go to school till university. That is what we discuss with the GID medical uh, uh, doctor for, for police cantonment. Now the money, they don't collect the money all of them, they don't give me. They can't approach me for police house. If it is not you, I know not today where I will be. I will be with my children. Even now, now I cry where they cry. Police say make everybody come out for those places where we they ask my sister. They talk. That is the reason you see me, I they cry. I don't know where I will go with my children. They don't give me benefit. They don't give me police. You earn money where they give my husband. They hold up. I don't know where I will go. Now my children last year my first son get university. You know like for Legos. You know go because ah! I don't have money. <laughs> Mama, if you remember, I come to your house. I tell you about this thing. You tell me that time, say, eh, good luck. Now, good luck, you sabi. Now, Buari, enter you. You know if it's she Buari now. You like say, now, good luck, you for carry me go there. If you remember, I come to your house because of that problem. So I don't know what I go do. Ordinary, I made. I don't know what I go do. No, Femi. Yes, <laughs> sir. Femi. Yes, sir. I go send you Mrs. Boniface account number. Make you send her one million naira. <laughs> you hear? I can hear. Sir. You hear? I can hear you, sir. Take it easy, sir. Uh, uh, Mrs. Boniface. 
who get you, you, give me your account number, may they send you one million naira. I hope the boy know, he no miss the admission. He don't miss him, so, sir. He don't miss the... All the same, hold now you one million naira. Now he's trying to write another exam. He don't miss him because now last year, mm -hmm. last year, he don't miss him. He don't go get him again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, mommy Boniface, sir? we go talk to Unilag. We, uh, they, they go feel consider him. Because now, of, now often he be, and everybody know the situation, waiting for the country, so that if now to give them, um, use the same admission, may then give them um, uh, next admission. But you go keep the one million naira with you, please. Um, you go quickly give the account number because the money we did the account no plenty. Make a uh, no call and dash them to another person again, please. Okay, sir. So, by uh, my brothers and sisters, when I don't, oh, Femi, thank you. Uh, why am I confused? Uh, Mrs. Boniface, go sit down. Okay. Um, when I hear waiting, the wife of a police officer will serve this country. So they then send them to go another country. The day where this thing happened. Now the president of Liberia, they carry, they go. That thing don't look like normal accident. It be like saying I attack, they attack them. But when I know the thing will pay me pass, when the suman carry cry come here, that time police get representative here with they call IG Lizon. One Sally so Agaisa. He there for studio. He open mouth. He talks say these people now illegal operation then go. Coincidentally. Coincidentally, it does say these people now illegal operation then go for that country. Luckily, one man will be say him and her husband, in fact, now her husband or guy he be, then they together for that operation. In fact, now together the accident, the, the incidents happen. The man, I don't know, when I still get that man number, I make a call him for me, I beg. When I get that man number, my, my, Mrs. Boniface, you get that man number, the man with uh, inside moto. They listen to the program one, the other day when Sally Su Agaisa, the IG Lizon, talk, say, your husband and in, in, in colleagues now illegal operation, then go. Where the man abandoned the journey, they go Kaduna, he make turn, come back, come talk, say, if I, if the, the thing will, will help us that day, the man photocopied the daily order of where, how they take, deploy them to carry it out that operation, if not be so. People for belief say, na illegal operation, you can imagine the Nigerian police denying one of its own that died an honorable death. I was a leader during that operation. That okay, collect microphone, sir. Very good. Oh, you see? Yes. I was, I was, I was so... Side. Sir, sit down, sir. sit down, sit down, sit here for front. No, for front, sir. <laughs> I was the person who did it. Yes, I was in charge in charge that section. I was the person reading that section. The vice president had to come from a border, so they send the signal that we should leave. Then we go there. The, the vice president was not coming, uh, was not uh, uh, coming in time, so we have to step down. Then later on, they send the signal again that it's on the way now no, we should leave and that the road that is no good mm. very very bad road so we should leave we should leave immediately immediately they had two car then are uh, you there in liberia with them yes i was i was them i have had what two car your rank then i was a uh, one star mm -hmm. that time mm -hmm. so i i looked at the other vehicle i don't see the vehicle then i carry one 
And only, only me inside the car with the driver. Mm. I say, okay, when they come, because it's so good that when we reach nobody, when the vice president will face us before our, our arrival. Then I went with the driver, me alone, me and the driver will go there. I tell Bonnie that when you, when the other DC come, the other driver come, make have come follow up, come In fact, I was surprised even here. I had, I was together with Bonnie when oh. this thing happened. Oh, you know her husband? I know the husband, sir. I know the husband. We were together in the Liberia. Ah! In charge. Now, for those of you who you know they had not to condemn the Nigerian police. The ones who are still there alive, they see waiting these people they pass through. And when I want because they be animals, they go sit down, may they take them do your hair like this. No, check them now. Check them.